that we're going to see some sick moves on stage, or may even hear about how dance has inspired humankind. But before we begin seeing anybody bust a move out there, I would like to take a moment to introduce our wonderful student council mayor, Miss Anna. As you already know, the annual beauty pageant has arrived. This is a way for our girls to really share their important life skills while also having fun. It's a way to learn the difference between winning and losing and gaining friendships. That's true. Remember, whether you win this pageant or not, there is in fact no losing. Everyone has entered is here to reveal their talent. I hope by entering this beauty pageant, every one of you girls feel the best version of yourselves. That you may feel the beautiful women that you really are. Getting up on stage in front of everyone is certainly scary and overwhelming. But hold your heads high and remember, it's about having fun and feeling beautiful on the inside too that counts. Beauty isn't about having a great outward appearance, it's about having a pretty mind, heart, and soul. Be true to yourself and just have a fun time sharing your talents and join it with your friends. Thank you and have a fun time. Thank you, Anna. Now, at this time, I would like to introduce our student council chaplain, Mr. Richie, to come say a prayer for all of our wonderful contestants. Our dear Heavenly Father, we are grateful today to gather here as a student body to watch this Miss SHS pageant. We pray for the contestants to, to do their hard work and to be their best, and to and for all of us as we watch this pageant to be a, be <clears throat> appropriate the pageant, but but most importantly to <clears throat> to cheer on their fel our fellow girls as they prepare to get on stage for us and and do dance moves and <clears throat> and please help us again as a student body to to behave ourselves and to and to be and to <clears throat> and to and to well and to. <clears throat> and to um, welcome the the Stewart Homeschool SHS pageant girls and 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 to cheer them on. In your name we pray. Amen. Amen and thank you so much, Richie. Now I think we are ready for our opening number. job. We really did see some sick moves out there. Now, let's introduce our contestants. 
Up first, we have Katie, Gianna, Heather, Kristen, Tina, Lindsay, The Dude, Michelle, Carol Annie, Nancy, Jamie, Talia, Julie, Allison, Elizabeth, Abby, Kayla, Jennifer, Marta, Sophia, Shannon, Potsy, Ellen, Caroline, and Amanda. Thank you so much, ladies. You all did a fantastic job. Now, I would like to take this time to introduce our mistresses of ceremony. Please give a warm welcome to Mrs. Sandy Bell, Dr. Kara Davies, and joining us for her very first pageant, Mrs. Carrie McIntyre. again for all those ladies. These ladies have worked so hard and you can tell it just by that opening number, right? It makes me want to dance with somebody. So as Trey, as Trey said, today is part one of our pageant. So we will get to see all of the wonderful talents they have been practicing. Then tomorrow we will get to learn a little bit more about each contestant and see who will be crowned Miss SHS. So let's get to the talent. <laughs> Uh, you, you like me when I happy found my link with a quake be hot and a kiss and me to you. What do you say you like me to? Wow. How about a great big round of applause for those ladies? I don't know about you all, but I sure did love that act. <laughs> Up next to the stage, we are going to have Miss Abby, Jennifer, and Marta busting it down to the electric slide. <laughs> singing Dancing Queen. Yeah. 
It seems like we not only have a couple dancing queens, but we definitely have some singing queens participating. Now, up next to the stage, I would like to welcome Miss Julie reading Beneath the Stars by Christy and Martin. Beneath the Stars by I'm sorry. Dance beneath the stars. There's even as long as they're dreaming and dreaming and I. Night up on her take you to the mining and the melts of sky. Uh, the name, the family nature, the bright animals in the skin. Swing them well, the there's the magic sea sand. Julie, for that beautiful poem. Up next to the stage, we have Talia and Jamie dancing to Vogue. Thank <laughs> you. 
Michelle singing Can't Stop the Feeling. Oh, yeah! 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 It's not my fault. It goes electric, maybe when I turn it on. Off to my city, up to my home. 
stop the feeling that she did a much better version of that than Justin Timberlake ever could. <laughs> now, at this time, I would like to welcome The Dude, reading Dance Till You Reach the Moon by Clive Blake. Dance Till You Reach the Moon, they'll always march to another journey, they'll always dance to another tune, but march in your own heartbeat, dance in dance till you reach the moon. Thank you, dude, for those wonderful words. And I don't see us stopping dancing anytime soon. Now, next up to the stage, we have Ellen, Amanda, and Caroline dancing to We Got the Beat. Thank you. 
No question about it, those girls sure do have the beats. Yep. Now, up next to the stage, we would like to welcome Miss Kristen, Tina, and Lindsay, dancing to everyone's favorite, Shake It Off. Thank you. 
Ladies sure did a fantastic job and helped to shake off those first day nerves. Now at this time, I would like to introduce our new associate superintendent, Mrs. Carrie McIntyre. contestants tomorrow and I know that we're all very excited to see which con contestant is going to be crowned the new Miss SHS. Yes. We also have a lot of other great awards that we're going to be giving out and you can tell that everybody has worked so very hard so we are very proud of all of our ladies but for now we're going to have to wait. Thank you for being so respectful to everybody and thank you for encouraging all of the contestants. It takes a lot to get out here and show off all of those talents. So thank you so much to all of you. Let's give ourselves one big round of applause. So yesterday, all of these lovely ladies who I'm going to introduce to you had the opportunity to display their talents to you, and you were the most wonderful audience. And so today we're going to learn a little bit more about them and then we will announce their titles. Are you ready? Yeah! So first we're going to introduce Miss Allison. Oh. Allison's parents and guardians are Craig and Lori. She's from California. Nice. Her correspondent is Kyla. Yep. Her house parent is Miss Rose, and she is on self care. Yes. This is Allison. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. And next we have Amanda. Yes. Amanda's parents and guardians are David and Linda. She's from New Jersey and Florida. Nice. Her correspondent is Miss Alicia, yeah. and her house parent is Anita. She's also on self care. Miss Amanda. <laughs> and next we have Tina. <laughs> Tina's parents and guardians are Anna and Jerry. Her home state is Tennessee. Her correspondent is Miss Rachel. Yay. Her house parent is Rose, and she's also on self care. This is Tina. This is Miss Lindsay. Yay. Lindsay's guardian is her mother, Dale. She is from Ohio. Her correspondent is Miss Alicia, and her house parent is Della. Yeah. Miss Lindsay. <laughs> now we have Abby. Oh, Abby's parents and guardians are Dexter and Melody. She's from Florida. Her correspondent is Kyla. Her house parent is Rose, and she's also on self care. Miss Abby. And now we have Jamie. Jamie's father and guardian, Michael, is here all the way from. Colorado. Nice. Her correspondent is Miss Abby, and her house parent is Miss Anita. Yeah. 
Jamie. Now we have Miss Caroline. Caroline, whose parents and guardians are Keith and Twinker. She's from Georgia. Her correspondent is Miss Alicia, and her house parent is Rose. Caroline. Miss Caroline. Marta. Marta's parents and guardians are Tama and Michelle. From state is Tennessee. Her correspondent is Miss Alicia, and her house parent is Angie. She's also on self care, Miss Marta. Miss <laughs> Kristen. <laughs> Kristen's father and guardian is Stephen. She's from Texas. Her correspondent is Mark, and her house parent is Miss Cindy. Miss Kristen. Next comes Shannon. Seven. Shannon's parents are Bob and Rosemary. She's from New York. The correspondent is Miss Rachel, and her house parent is Miss Mary Kay. And Shannon. Now we have Talia. Talia's parents are Jeff and Tamar. She's from California. Her correspondent is Ms. Kyla, and her house parent is Della, Miss Talia. Here comes Carolani. Carolani's guardians are her brothers, Rick and Jim. She is from Michigan. Her correspondent is Miss Amy, and her house parent is Della, Carolani. Now we have Gianna. Gianna! Gianna's parents are Joe and Gail. She's from New Jersey. Her correspondent is Rachel. And her house parent is Miss Anita. This is Gianna. Now we have Nancy. Nancy's brother and sister-in-law are Randy and Sally. She is from Virginia. Her correspondent is Miss Alicia. And her house parent is Miss Della. This is Nancy. Sophia. Sophia's parents are Steve and Molly. She is from Texas. Her correspondent is Sarah. And her house parent is Miss Rose. This is Sophia. Now we have Michelle. Michelle's mother and guardian is Debbie. She is from New Jersey. Her correspondent is Abby. And her house parent is Miss Cindy. This is Michelle. Here comes Katie. Katie's guardians are her aunt Lawrence and Uncle John. Her hometown is in Tennessee. Her correspondent is Rachel. And her house parent is Mary Kay. Miss Katie. And this is Julie. Julie's. Guardians in her family are David and Rose. She is from Tennessee. Her correspondent is Mark. And she lives on Camelot Self Care. Her house parent is Miss Cindy. This is Jennifer. Jennifer's guardians are her Aunt Char and Uncle Robert. She is from Ohio. Her correspondent is Rachel, and her house parent is Miss Cindy. Jennifer. And here comes sweet Heather. Heather's mom is Cheryl and her brother Michael. She's from Texas. Correspondent is Margaret. And her house parent is Miss Angie. This is Heather. And now we have Ellen. 
Ellen Gardner is Jennifer. She's from Connecticut. Her correspondent is Jeremy. And her house mother is Miss Anita. She lives on self-care. Miss Alfred. And this is Kayla. Yeah. Kayla's brother is Thomas, and her aunt Tracy are her guardians. Wow. She's from Tennessee. Her correspondent is Teresa, and her house mother is Miss Rose. This is Kayla. Welcome, Ponzi. Ponzi's father is Shepherd. She's from Georgia. Her correspondent is Miss Amy, and her house mother is Miss Della. This is Ponzi. Now, Miss Elizabeth. She is from Ohio. Her correspondent is Mary, and her house mother is Miss Deb. This is Elizabeth. And I want to introduce the dude. Her family is her brother Stan and her sister Stephanie. She is, as you can probably tell, from Louisville, Kentucky. And her house mother is Miss Anita. Please give all these ladies a round of applause. Didn't everyone look so beautiful? Let's give them a big round of applause. Our contestants are lovely and lovely. Uh, I know we are all anxious to hear the awards, but Rachel and Megan would like me to thank some very important people. Thank you to Margaret, Ashley, and Anna for stage direction. Trey up in the booth for sound and emceeing. Isn't he the best MC? Miles for his amazing videography and for the finishing touches on our stage decoration and hair and all that. The house parents for making sure everyone looks so great today. Hey. Chris Perry for making sure the gym looks so great. The contestants for their hard work. Yeah. And David Selwood for putting up with us. Without further ado, I'm sending it back to Trey and we'll get on with the award. Choose our first award, the embodiment of always going full effort, Miss Gianna with this 110 percent. One of our most kind, caring, and loving students. I would like to introduce Heather, Miss I Love You. Up next, I can't think of a more wonderful person to win this wonderful Sophia. <laughs> if you ever need a helping hand on campus, be sure to look out for our Miss Helpful winner, Shannon! We have an amazing student and a fabulous contestant. Please welcome this wonderful Tina.
Always level energy and enthusiasm. Please welcome next to the stage, Mrs. Enthusiastic Ellen. Is that the sun? No, wait, that's Miss Radiant, Amanda. Congratulations, sweet girl. Like to see the contrast, this person always knows how to impress. Please welcome Miss Razzle Dazzle Michelle. <laughs> This person can sell ice to an Eskimo. Give it up for Miss Charming Julie. I just want to be like that to say, Miss Divine, Boxy. Please welcome Mr. Geniality, the dude. 